Good morning, this is Calamity Crawling, and today I'm playing part three of Stories Untold. So this episode is the station process. I had a brief look at it and it looks a bit different to the other ones, but I really hope this can be the first episode that I don't have to redo. Let's jump in. Also, look at my jacket. I feel like I feel like I'm a cute army general, maybe. Hello? Ooh, this is some cold atmosphere. Hang on, let me get a blanket. My legs are cold. Oops. Oh, it's alright, it's nothing that breaks. Enter passcode. Oof, boy, it looks windy outside. Um, 030319. Six, eight, I'm assuming it's the, the code that's literally stuck right there. There he is. Finally, what took you? Is the microphone still broken in station three? Oh, take that as a yes. Yes, you can't reply. You should be able to hear you though. I can see activity registering, so your voice is definitely going to three. Okay. We can chat later, Bree. Yeah, this is pretty serious. I had a distress call from Central. There's a situation and we have to fire up signal monitoring and relay systems right away. What kind of situation? I don't know. I'm assuming it's got something to do with this storm. Whatever it is, it's big to want to involve us. Shit. Uh, okay, uh... what do we do then? Well, my fucking cabin car isn't holding up in this weather. So I can't process the signals myself. Yes, he's doing the processing. Two, you need to feed the frequency information through to the backup terminal in station three. And three, you just need to chain, decode, and process. Ooh, the tab function does the work. On the um, we'll oh no, I have regrets. It's simple, honestly. You can do this in your sleep. Okay, first one is due to appear in a minute or so. Have a quick read of that microfilm handbook. It should be on your left. I'm going to get suited up and restart the generator. Don't fuck it up. So, I'm assuming Hertz frequency thing. Um, so we want FM and 19. 30 three enter okay I'm going to stop him repeating in my ear because he sounds creepy as hell. Uh, Abacus. Right. Um. Oh god. How do I zoom in? Um. Zoom? Aha. Zoom. Um. That, oh god damn. That moved quickly. Um. Abacus is on page six. Oh, zoom out a little bit. Why is it wonky again? Oh yeah, because I did something wrong. So we want page six. Um, you page six? Where are the, aha, this is Abacus. Um, look at that bit of the page and zoom in. Zoom out a little. Focus? There we go. Must input the following command lines into terminal. Ah! You did not tell me I was going to have to code in this. Sit, uh, sys.exe minus d minus e. sys.exe uh, you did not tell me I was going to have to use my short term memory. We've been over this, it's bad. Minus D minus E. Uh, minus D minus E. 
enter. Okay, line two. Allocate 202 minus A. And those need spaces. For fuck's sake. Allocate. Oh, is allocate 1L or 2? Oh god, my, my flaws are really coming out now. Allocate. Ah, oh, I need to put spaces. Allocate 202 minus A. Allocate. Two O two minus A enter and then the last one output log minus false output log minus oh, false enter all right I'll do that one again. Oh. So that one was sys.exe space minus a minus e minus d minus e. That's a good start, isn't it? Minus d minus e. Enter, enter, execute. Yeah, I did code things. I'm doing it as fast as I can, Jesus Christ. Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, so this is USB. USB. Uh, turn it on. USB, and I want... 50 and I want 3,500 oh shit 500 damn it what to do when you're bad at numbers and keep pressing the wrong button What? Hang on. 20, All right, I get it, lady. 14, zero, Turn the fans one, back on. You don't need to hear them. Chevron! That's a thing on a car. Zoom out, focus, and let's look for Chevron. Where does Chevron come up on the thing? Oh, tell me, where is the Chevron? Chevron is page 20. Who boy, have we got a lot of scrolling to do? Whee! Ah, oh, bum, Chevron. Okay, let's rot oh, got rot rotate that way. You know how this just sometimes makes your life difficult? Right. Okay, that's close enough. Ref int. I'm gonna zoom in a bit, hang on. Where X is two, Y is five, and Z is six. Sixth number of broadcast code. Oh, nah, bro. Nah, uh uh, this is not fair. I did not sign up for this kind of. So I want the second, the fifth, and the sixth number from the stupid radio thing. Like, veto. Thank you. 
Just pushing this update to the transmitter now. Just getting the hang of it, huh? Next one coming up. So, um... What does GCS mean? GCS? What do you mean? GCS? Yeah, and this next one has come through with an additional note. GCS3 equals E1, V1, M1. I've not seen it before. Check the microfilm. Might be something in there about it. Listen. E1, let me know when you're done V1. with that one. I haven't heard back from the transport team. I'm starting to worry. Sure thing. Okay, here it is. Whoa. Okay, that's different. I'm just waiting for something that to pop up out there and scare me. Yeah, quite the warning sign. Shit. Something's going on. The last two must have just been testing the system. Tune it as normal and I'll see what I can find out once I get these goddamn lights on. Turn the fan on for a bit, cool down my computer, hope it doesn't blow up. Okay, so we are looking for AM. Uh, 11,320, okay. We're gonna be here a while, 20. Are you serious? You're expecting me to be able to discern the difference between the dots and the dashes in Morse code? Are you actually serious? Right. Focus. Let's go right back to the beginning and look for some fecking Morse code. Apparently. Right, where's the thing? Uh, focus better? Morse. Morse code, appendix 22. Okay, so you might as well grab a snack. We'll be here for a while, apparently. Seriously, you expecting me to be able to discern Morse code? Right, zero, nine, Seven seven thirty. I had to write this down because it took me, no word of a lie, about 15 minutes to figure this out. Like, I understand that you want to make a game challenging, but you reached the point where I was genuinely considering giving up playing, and it's only the fact that I can't get on to the next episode until I finish that one that is the reason I'm still playing this level. I'm not enjoying this level. Like, it's pretty and atmospheric, but I'm just not having any fun. Kansas. I feel like I'm being... Oh. I feel like I'm being dragged ass backwards through a hedge, and like, I'm not actually smart enough to figure out what's going on because I'm backwards, frontwards, or so, you know. I just don't have the materials or the tools or, I don't know, the brain capacity to figure this out. I am not enjoying myself. Next one. That wonky bothers me. Oh, um, so I'm looking for, I forgot, Kansas. Uh, zoom in. Where's Kansas? It's eight. Okay. Kansas. Oh, I never thought I'd actually be happy to see code. Where X, largest number from original broadcast, and Y, smallest number from original broadcast. So, once again, upon further research, it turns out original broadcast is original Morse broadcast. Because this is totally obvious to me. Okay, one, we're done. Nothing has happened really, all good. 
What did you want? I'm about to head outside to look at this generator. My cabin is completely out. Listen, I just checked the roster and we were supposed to hear from the supply team Eight. three days ago. But I had nothing. No responses either. Shit. The dawn? I hope not. Three, can you monitor a range for me? They're using emergency signals somewhere between eight, eight and a half thousand range. FM. See if you can track it down for me. F um supply for the next six months. If they turn back, what do we do? We can reschedule. I'm more worried that they didn't turn back. Otherwise we'd be having a drink by now. The boat was called 20 F. God, yeah. Okay. Three. Eight, eight and a half thousand FM somewhere. See if you can pick up a distress signal or something. Eight, eight and a half FM. Okay. Signal for me. Does anyone read? Not supply vessel 20 F. Do you read me? Oh my god, that's them. This is a distress signal from supply vessel 20 F. Please respond. Is anyone there? Stop arguing, bitch, and lock your door. Shit, one, there's another GCS signal coming in. Do we, do we process it, Phil? Yes, as long as the GCS number is going up, we're helping a lot of people. It was three last time, it's six this time, what does it mean? That's good, that's good, just process the signals. Okay. Press it in. Okay, so I'm assuming... They're using a slightly different Nike, Zulu, Sierra. Sierra. Hero. H. Hotel, sorry. Bravo. Okay, um, if I zoom in a bit and then fo focus. I feel like I'm having an eye test. Um, what? Frequency. What frequency are we at? 6970. 6970. Okay, so N is... Right, so it was the Zan value, but now I've got to find Centaur. Centaur, Centaur, Centaur. Sacrifice Jennifer to go home. Is Jennifer the name of my colleague? It's like I've never met her, so I'm not averse to it. Oh, I'm so happy there's no more maths to do here. I think I did that. At least I think I did. I don't know what I'm looking at. Cabling? 
Am I a bad alien? Am I launching? Am I letting the aliens into the world? B eight one fifty. All right, you've said your piece. Enough for you. Okay, so one eight nine zero four five. Oh, I don't like where this is going. Guys, are any of you walking around in that storm? That's crazy. You'll get yourself killed. No one's outside. You're seeing things, for. I think there's something outside. Uh, zoom in. Make it a bit straighter. Zoom in and focus. X numbers 1 and 2 from 3 original broadcast represent a longitude. Numbers 1, 2 and 3, so it's 189. 3, number station 3, this is station 4, do not go out there. Authorization word from appendix C. Do not go out there. I have no plan on it, honestly. Anyone who does go outside with all of this stuff going on is their own problem. Appendix C. Um, okay. Let's do some turning. Okay, let's um, zoom. Start. Uh, let's zoom out a little bit. Focus. Signal, signal, shit, what was the signal? Was it in USB? Okay, signal is in USB. Broadcast frequency, it was 8,000. To to process total number, there are six. Uh, so, there are six. Total, one thirty. no. Alexander. Alexander. Oh, I did it first try. First time that's bloody happened. What am I doing? Three. James. The last thing I haven't sent. My terminal is going crazy demanding a response. I think the wind is misaligned the transmitter or something. We need to go out to it. Nope. Please, James. I'm sorry, but I can't get out. I'm trapped. No. You'll Oh, you're actually making me go outside. You suck. I don't want to go outside. 
There are things. I'm going to die. Bitch. Why did I even put on my proper safety gear and shit? I should have put on my safety gear and shit. If I didn't, I'm an idiot. Guess I'm going up. I'm yelling timber. But I am not, because I am gonna die. Okay, am I having some issue with climbing stairs, or...? What's happening? Can I not climb the stairs? Oh, yeah, I can. I just needed to brute force it. Hang on, H.I. Oh! Do -do -do -do. Um, gotta say, this is not my most favourite of the levels. I like when I have to think about wordy things. I do not like when I have to think about numbery things. God, it's cold and it's windy. Why am I doing this? Whatever this job is, they clearly are not paying enough money for me. Because I'm going to die. I hope my family get a good severance check. Or whatever the right name for what happens when you're killed in the line of duty is. I know it won't necessarily make it better, but like... This isn't how I wish to go. because it's open I've done it okay and then I follow the wire to another box Now where do I go? One, two, three. Ow, itchy. Can I go home now? Coma. What? This person's in some kind of mental safe safe place? For something called No Code Studios, you're sure making me do a lot of damn coding. So, that was episode three. We got through it eventually. 
Um, cannot say it's by any stretch of anyone's imagination anywhere near my favourite of the three so far. Um, don't entirely understand what's going on, but hopefully the last episode will answer some questions for us. But I hope you have a very lovely day, and most importantly, you do you.